I'm excited for one reason. Today, for the first time ever on this channel, I'm going to be doing something that I've never done before on this channel, and that is blind reacting to some wrestling botches. There have been people who follow some of my other social medias where I do post wrestling content like Twitter or X, sorry, X as they're calling it nowadays, right? Uh, Instagram, TikTok, where I post wrestling content. People asking me to blind react to like some wrestling flashback moments or just some, you know, cool wrestling stuff or wrestling botches has been highly requested. So today is what we're going to do, blind react to some wrestling botches. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm a little bit nervous because I feel like there's going to be some things in here that are going to be very gruesome to watch. Some of the stuff I probably have seen throughout social media on like clips and stuff, but I have no idea what I'm getting myself into. So we're going to test this and see how it goes. But before we start, please to make sure you guys subscribe, like, share, comment below, and turn on the notifications for all all wrestling content that'll be updated on this channel and to be updated when we go live every Sunday, 5 p.m. Eastern Time Zone for the No Name Wrestling Podcast. Very unique name. We couldn't come up with a name for the podcast, so we decided to say, we got a no name, bro, so we're the No Name Wrestling Podcast. We do allow the subscribers and viewers to come on the podcast as well. This is one of the platforms where we allow people who watch the show, who want to come on with us and chat wrestling or debate with us from time to time and casually. We do allow people who subscribe to come on the show and chat with us from time to time when we do open Open mics. We just did an episode about two weeks ago. Be sure to check it out on this channel. So, with that being said, let's dive into this. Like I said, I have no idea what I signed myself up for, but we're going to find out, man. So let's go. I don't know what y'all got me into. Red Velvet's not messing around. Red one of my favorites yeah. in the AWS. Yeah. I believe the Australia fight. show. Looking for a pedigree. Looking for a pedigree again. Oh. I've seen this one too, but that was uh, two old men wrestling. Yeah. 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 Oh, oh, I have not seen that one. Golly. And on his head. Whoa, 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 bro. Head got caught between the ropes. Hold up, bro. I'm going to go back to that. I have actually never seen that before. Oh, my gosh, bro. I believe that's how, like, Mick Foley lost one half of his ear, too, bro. His head got caught between the ropes. That's... God, that's got to be scary. And you know, the ropes are really tight right there, too, man. So, pause, man. So, I mean, that probably... Ooh, man. Okay. I can already tell this looks like it's gonna turn out bad, bro. Yeah, I already felt like it was gonna turn out terrible. This is old school. Oh! Oh my gosh, bro. Is that, is that Stone Cold? Like an old Stone Cold with brown hair? Oh! Holy crap, bro. Whoa, 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 whoa. I was not expecting that. She went full force at first. Oh my gosh! On the hardwood is crazy. Of ACH. Walking those oh my gosh, bro. She went full force. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. I didn't fully see that. Wait a minute. What, what's happening? He could have just dislocated the arm of ACH. Walking those. Ladies and gentlemen, Oh my gosh, on the steps. Jaw first on the steps. Let me turn this down a little bit just in case it's a little bit too loud. Oh my gosh, bro. Jaw on the... Bro, look at that. Jaw on the steps, bro. His jaw gotta be cracked or something, bro. No way he did that and didn't crack something in his jaw, bro. On the step... No, nah, that's wild. I've seen this one many times throughout social media, and I've actually heard this guy didn't get hurt either. Like, didn't break anything. I mean, I'm sure he probably was sore the next day and stuff, but I've heard, like, this guy was totally fine after, which is crazy. Like, completely missed the table and landed on concrete, too. Ooh, man, that could have turned out really bad. She thinks people like superstars. <laughs> Charlotte kicking at, kicking at the ghost. Kicking at Casper the ghost. God damn it. I knew. Oh, see, bro. Oh, my gosh, bro. The neck and head, bro. God, man. I don't know if I can handle those. This is going to turn out terrible. He's going to land on his head. He's going to land on his freaking head, isn't he? Oh, okay. Uh, that just turned out to be something I didn't expect. Oh. This one, Matt Hardy missed the elbow. Yep, remember that. Remember that. Remember this as well. Remember this as well. Powerhouse Hobbs, CM Punk. No, no, no. This one, they messed up the Hurricane Rana spot. Stuff like this happens too. So I remember this. I remember this. Oh yeah. Oh my God. Oh man, I have no idea what this is gonna look like. Oh, okay, that didn't turn out to be what I thought it was. I thought it was going to be something more dangerous. Oh, my gosh, hold up. I thought that one was going to be worse. The table breaks. 
but then pushes outwards. I've never seen that. The table snaps, but then pushes Maybe outwards. Just, That's crazy. Maybe he just doesn't like Sabian. Oh, yeah, he don't know what he's doing. He don't know what he's doing. He don't know what he's doing, bro. He don't know what he's doing. He has no idea. He stepped. <laughs> Hold on. Why did he kick him at the end, bro? That was so unnecessary. Disrespectfully kicked that man at the end. Like, bro, messed up your spot, bro. I don't know if that was, like, him being mad that he kicked him or just in the moment. But the fact that he kicked him, that's kind of crazy. Because he messed up three spots in a row and then he just kicked him afterwards. Like, come on, bro. Oh, damn. God, this is gonna... I'm always afraid it's going to be something to do with the head and the neck, bro. Like, somebody landing on their head. Oh, okay. That wasn't as bad as that. Oh, got the ropes. The Holy crap. Too cold, Scorpio, Val Venus. Yeah. Good old attitude arrow. No I'll never forget this. This is when Montez stepped on the table and it broke. This is one of the funniest moments they did, bro. This is back when Roman used to wrestle on SmackDown. This is crazy. This is when Roman used to have matches There's on no SmackDown. Stepped on the table and just casually broke gave it. He looked at it like, bro. Oh, his chest. Uh, this was in Saudi Arabia, yep, when Jinder didn't get hit with the whisper in the wind and still sold it. Commend him for still selling it, though, but yeah. That looked terrible. Oh, my God. Is that Sabu and Matt Hardy? Jesus, that turned out to be absolutely terrible. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What just happened there? What just happened there? What just happened there? This dude... <laughs> Hold on. I gotta see it one more time. Is that Jeff Cobb? I think that's Jeff Cobb. He just went full force out of the ring with his momentum. Oh, wow. The table just gave away like that, bro. That's a very weak table. He, he walking around like, oh my gosh. Oh, he definitely, he definitely got to be here. I've seen this many times, bro. I've seen that so many times on social media. And every time I see it, it, it honestly, it's just, it's hilarious every time. Every time I see it, it turns out to be even more like crazy. Like, hold on, let's go, let's go to it. Let, let's look at this. Me the world is one more time. Let's look at this one more time. Bro, the fact that he completely like didn't even come close. And the ref, look at the ref! The ref almost fell off the ring because of the momentum. I've seen this a lot on social media too. Fell backwards, couldn't get into the ring. I know they clowned him in the locker room. I know they made fun of him in the locker room for sure. This is an old school video. Is that Bret Hart back in like the 1970s? Oh my gosh. Oh, one, two, three, get. Oh my gosh, on the concrete. Jesus. Oh my gosh, bro. He didn't even go anywhere. How do you do a shooting star and not go anywhere? Mid air. Did he say fuck it too? The fact that he said fuck it and still missed. He didn't even go anywhere. He literally just jumped in the air and just landed right down on the ropes. And Santana, another uh -oh. very impressive newcomer here to show. Oh! She recently. That's uh, when A Train broke his neck. Gosh, man, the neck, man, the neck and head. Oh! Back when Ricochet still had hair, but that hairline was definitely faded. You could see the hairline was barely hanging on by a thread. Barely hanging on by a thread. Oh my gosh, the ropes, bro. You can see right there. Look at that Ricochet hairline, bro, right there. Barely hanging on by a thread, but it was there, though. It was there, man. It was there. Oh my gosh, though, the ropes. Whoever put up those ring ropes, man, they get fired. They get fired, bro. They getting fired. Abushi Okada. Oh my gosh, Abushi Okada. And now Brian Cage. Brian Cage. Coming off the rope. Who? 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 Dude, no way he didn't break his neck on that. No way he didn't break his neck on that. Coming off the rope. Oh, dude. Oh my gosh, bro. <sighs> Stuff like that is so scary because you literally could get paralyzed. Like, you could literally get paralyzed like this, bro. That's, oh my gosh, dude. Oh, shit. Oh, oh my gosh. I remember this. I remember this. Matt Seidel, Evan Bourne. Yeah, I remember that. I remember that. Billy Kidman. Oh my gosh. Shooting star on the ropes. That definitely had to hurt. Holy crap! Dude! 
Some of these are like, oh my gosh. Ooh. Let's give him a Brock Lesnar WrestleMania 19 vibes right there. I think I've seen this. I think this is when the ropes broke or something like that. Yep, yep, yep. I remember that. I remember seeing that. This is GCW. I have not seen this. Which is not bad. I mean, well, they wrestling in the backyard somewhere. This going to be bad. Oh, not as bad as I thought it was. Okay, that's not what I thought it was going to be. Oh, oh my gosh. Not into the fence. Good Lord, Nasty Leroy. Nasty Leroy? Did he just say Nasty Leroy? Which is not bad. Did he just call that man Nasty yeah, Leroy? Out. Is that his name? And Leroy just puts him through the table. Good Lord, Nasty Leroy. Nasty Leroy is bonkers. Oh my gosh, bro. On the yeah. fence. Who? Oh, bro, the rope's breaking. That's got to be one of the scariest things ever. I remember that. I remember that. Oh my gosh, bro. Just not going anywhere mid-air is crazy. Oh, this is somebody's backyard, bro. It's definitely going to turn out bad. Yep, yep. I knew it was going to turn out bad. I know that had to hurt. Big Show attempting to do the worm. They had this man doing all types of crap. And not to mention, Rikishi got up before he even fell down. Oh, yeah, that was bad. That was bad. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. He was going for the monkey flip. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Look at this man. <laughs> He's trying to reach out, bro. He's trying to reach out for the spot, bro. This man look like he about to go for a swim or something like that, bro. That Honestly, some of these are kind of funny to see because sometimes botches and mess-ups, they can be funny, you know, because sometimes like, oh, we mess up that spot. As long as you don't get hurt. The ones where people get hurt, those are the ones that are like, ooh, nah, bro. Yeah, I remember this. This is when uh, Del Rio slipped on the ropes, missed the spot to kick Big Show. I remember that. He still had to sell it. Still had to sell it. I remember this, I'm not going to see it, I'm not going to watch it because he landed on the top of his head. I've seen that many times, I watched that live. Dude landed on the top of his head, he literally could have snapped his neck in two, bro. He literally could have snapped his neck in two. Ooh, that one didn't look too bad. That one didn't look too bad. Oh, never mind, okay. I didn't see that angle where he landed on his head. Let me tell y'all something. After this, because I'm going to rewind it again. I'm gonna go back and rewind it again. I'm gonna go back and rewind it again to the full moment. Hold up, hold up. I was at this WrestleMania in Texas, AT&T Stadium where the Cowboys play. I was at this WrestleMania. The experience of WrestleMania is something like I'll never forget. This was my first WrestleMania ever. It was an experience, like I said, I'll never forget. And being live in person, this was one of the funniest things of the weekend. Vince messing up the stunner because... When they announced the Pat McAfee match, you're like, why are they having this match? And when Austin came out, you knew Vince was going to take the stunner. But in everybody's mind, I think everybody was thinking, even if people weren't talking to each other, like, can Vince take the stunner? He's like 70-something plus years old, bro. Like, can he even take the stunner? And that question got answered quickly that day because the answer was no, bro. Absolutely not. And it wasn't even a moment that you were mad at. It was just a comical moment. Like, that was one of the funniest WrestleMania moments maybe ever that wasn't planned to happen the way it was, but it, it forever is funny. He took the worst stunner of all time. The fact that he was slipping and like, oh my gosh, it was so hilarious. And Stone Cold was laughed afterwards too, bro. Comical. Arguably the greatest WrestleMania match ever had a botch in it too. That's crazy to say. Oh, oh, fool. My gosh. Oh yeah, Pandora's out. Wait a minute, total sex to see. Sex to see? The man said sex to see. Oh man, that was a wild punch by Undertaker. Wild punch. See, this is in a backyard. Is he wearing a gorilla suit? Not even a backyard. Oh my gosh, he landed right. Right on the ground, bro. I know his tailbone, bro. He could have broke his tailbone. His lower back. You're gonna have to go to a chiropractor, bro. Oh, and to hear the impact is even crazier. Oh my gosh. Oh, I remember this. This is when Luchasaurus had to like tell this dude what to do. Like live on TV. And yep, yep, I remember that. Oh man, I mean, he, he a little old. He a little old and slow, so we give him a pass. On that. Rock! Hmm, bottom. Okay, that's the not a rock bottom. That's a that's, that's just a that's just a bottom. That was just called the bottom without the rock in it. Oh my gosh, landed on top of his head. Oh, and then he got hit in the back of the neck. Jesus! 
I'm sorry. Hold on. They couldn't do it. The fact that this dude lands on his head and then he gets hit right in the back of the neck. Dude. Oh my gosh, bro. The fact that some of these people legitimately don't break their necks is, is mind-blowing to me on, the, on those moves, dude. I'm afraid to see this. This is a bigger individual, so... Oh, he slipped! Oh, the other dude got out the way quick. He said, nah, let me get out the way. Let me get out the way. Saved his own life. The fact Vader knows so that is crazy! Casually no so that kick is wild, bro. He did not give a fuck. He said, I ain't selling that shit. <laughs> yeah, that dude don't know what he's doing at all. Yeah, he don't know what he's doing at all. Triple A. I don't know, Kenny Omega doesn't mess up too much, so I don't know what this is going to look like. Oh, he didn't catch him. It wasn't even Kenny's fault. God damn, he didn't even catch him. Ooh, I'm afraid. Oh, this is going to turn out bad, isn't it? Oh my gosh! Holy crap, dude! Steve Mongo McMichael in here with Kevin Sullivan. Mongo McMichael gets oh, shaken nah. down hard by Kevin Sullivan. And oh nah! This dude don't know what he's doing at all. And did he know sold the stomp? Hold up, man. You know what makes this even worse? You know what makes that even worse? I'm gonna tell y'all. What makes this even worse? Rick Flair, Rick Flair, Arn Anderson are standing on the apron. Two of the best entering workers ever. Rick Flair, arguably the greatest ever, standing on the side of the ropes right there, watching this happen. Why are they even in this match? They're probably like, "What is going on here? Why are we in this situation? What are we doing here? We don't belong here." Gets taken down hard by Kevin Sullivan. Kevin Sullivan to uh, Dean Mal is that Dean Malenko? It might be Dean Malenko. I don't know who that is over there. Oh my gosh. This dude doesn't know what he's doing. Oh, that's not it. I didn't even see this part. Oh, he definitely does not know what he's doing. Oh my gosh. I feel bad for Ric Flair and Arn Anderson. Why are they even in that situation? Oh, that that was just funny. That wasn't even like a botch, I don't think. Table broke. Couldn't do nothing about that. Greatest bulldog of all time, bro. Damn. Greatest bulldog in the history I've ever seen. Oh, oh, the table didn't break. Those are like New Japan tables, man. Those tables are like very, very hard to break. Oh! Oh my goodness. Now they're gonna get the one, two, three cover for the win and they missed the move. That's embarrassing. That's gotta be embarrassing, man. Those are like the frustrating the frustrating botches. Stuff like that is like the frustrating ones where like tables break and you're not trying to break them and stuff. Heat will be heated. Nobody. He doesn't have a oh. good experience around the concession stand. He, uh, he, he, he tried to execute that move well. Is he looking for a swanton? Oh! Oh, yeah, this was like starting of the death of WCW when they missed the blood spot. The blood drops. Now what? Doesn't even land on him. And he had to look over like, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> WCW was a shit show, boy. A uh, shit show. Shit show, not show. Oh my gosh, yo! What? <laughs> hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> The fact that he's struggling just to make the move as well because his head's stuck in the dude's pants, bro. Nah, that was see that one was funny. That one was funny. Oh, that one hurt though. No, oh, yeah, that one. Oh, and the table breaks afterwards. Golly. Alright, I'm gonna plug in the YouTube channel where I found this from. Pro Wrestling Nation. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. I'm actually gonna subscribe myself right now, man. Subscribe to the channel. Uh, they do a bunch of combinations like this, so there are more that I'll probably check out and watch on the channel if you guys want me to. Oh my gosh. Some of these were like really, really like, whoo, man. A little, a little bone chilling. This, uh, this, this wasn't as bad as I thought. There were some that are like very hard to watch. The ones where people look like they're gonna break their neck, bro. Ah, those are the ones that I, I just, ah, those are the ones that are very hard to watch, man. But if you want to see me react to more videos like that, leave it in the comment section below for more suggestions. If you want me to react to different type of wrestling videos that aren't botches or whatever, just wrestling related, also leave it in the comment section below.